What's up everyone, I'm Dr. Josh Jagoda and today I'm going to show you how to mobilize your forearms in a dynamic stretching posture. We're all used to stretching the arms a little bit like this or like this, but today I'm going to show you a quick little way how to dynamically stretch them. So the first things I like to do is I'll start kind of warming up my fingers a little bit and I'll start shaking out the fingers each individually just because we know that the tendons go from the forearm and into the fingers so we might as well just start stretching them out a little bit. So I'll pull on them a little bit and I'll start grasping a little bit and then I'll start shaking my hands out a little bit. Um, I'll pull gently each of them back in every direction just like this just to warm up my hands and then I'll start kind of massaging my my forearms or I'm sorry with the palms of my hands just to start loosening it up but now that that is done the next thing I'll start doing instead of the dynamic stretch because we I mean sorry the static stretch we want a dynamic stretch and this is going to be really good for pre-activity so the, the static stretching like this is going to be really good for after you've done your lifting after you've done your event but statically, um, it's not as good as dynamic for before an actual event or activity. So the next thing I'll do is I'll just shake my arms out. I'll shake them out while my arms are flexed, and I'll also shake them out while they're extended like this, right? So the next thing, finally after that, the next warm-up or the real dynamic stretch is I'll come into here. I'll go like this, and I'll sit back, and I'll rock and I'll come back and forward and I'll rock back and forward just like this and if you see me from this this angle I'll just kinda go back and forth rocking back and forth I'll change my positions of my hands going forward I'll angle them out I'll come out this way back and if you're really flexible enough and you don't have shoulder problems you can do this one of the also one of the things you also want to take care of is the arms bent as well as fully extended. There's two different muscles there, so you wanna make sure that you get those as well. And then of course, you can alternate back and forth between the flexors and the extenders. So you can go flex, rock, backwards. Flex, and then the extenders. And I'll just show you from this angle what it looks like. Flexing, extending. Working on the flexors, stretching the extenders, back and forth, changing the angles, side to side, working the forearms dynamically so that you can really start getting your body ready for activity. Again, dynamic stretching is really good for warming up the body and really good prior to an event. The static stretching is really good after an event to help you recover. All right, guys? I'm Dr. Josh Chagoda. Thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you guys for the next episode. Bye.